Hi, I'm Sophia, and this is my friend Rylan. Like you, we're new to SuccessMaker and need a little help getting started. Want to explore together? We'll learn how to log in, select your course, and complete your work. Let's get started. To log in, just use the username and password your teacher provided. Then, click a program to begin. Once you log in, click the play button to start your session. A short, fun video will play. Let's look at an example. Barrett and Chameleon, they are here to learn with you. Barrett talks and talks, and the fish will lend a helping fin. Hamster helps keep the pace, and Bug always thinks things through. You can skip this video anytime by clicking here. Now, let's take a closer look at some of the other things in the reading program. Hmm. If you're wondering what to do next, try clicking these books over here. You may be asked to select an avatar to guide you through a reading passage. Pick the one you like best. As you read through a passage, click this icon to activate your avatar. She'll give you useful tips to help you better understand the reading passage. Click the X to close the box and move forward. At the top of your screen, you'll find several helpful tools. Sometimes I like to highlight important parts of a passage. I simply click the highlight icon, then click and drag over the text I want highlighted. To delete the highlighted area, Click the icon again and select the eraser to remove. Use the notes icon to insert a note into the passage. Click X to close the note. To reopen a saved note, click this small red triangle here. To hide all notes, click hide notes. You may see the read to me icon on your screen. If you want a paragraph read aloud, Click the icon and position your cursor at the beginning of the paragraph. To turn it off, simply click the icon again. Do you sometimes lose your place when you're reading? Me too. To help me keep track of where I am, I use the text tracker. I slide it down as I read each line of text so I know exactly where I am in the passage. In case you forget some of the tools I've shown you, just click the help icon. It'll show you how to use all of these tools again. If you need instructions on what to do next, click the instruction icon. As you read a passage, the go to activity icon will appear whenever there is a question about the text. Read through the questions and click the correct answers. Then click done. If you need to go back to the passage to help you respond, click here. Oops, I almost forgot to show you the menu icon. I use it to access the glossary. Just type in a word you don't know to get the definition and have it read aloud to you. You can also use the menu icon to check your progress and change the volume so you can hear better. One last thing. I want to make sure you know how to answer the different types of questions you might see in the program. Here are a few samples. For find it questions, you may get a map. Simply read the question and then move your mouse over the various objects on the map to find the correct answer. Then click done. Another type of find it exercise may ask you to read a statement and find the correct answers. Just click all of the correct responses, then click done. For fill in the blanks, just read the question and review possible answer choices. Drag and drop the correct answer into the blank space, then click done. Mix it up is another type of question. In this activity, Bug takes you to a factory to practice a skill. Here, you'll read a question, then drag and drop the correct answer into the blank. Then what? Yep, you guessed it, click done. For some passages, 
you'll need to scroll here to read the text and then respond to a series of five questions. Read each question, click an answer, then click the go forward arrow. After you've answered all five questions, click done. When your session is over, click the X to close the progress report. Don't forget to click log out to end your session. Here are some important final tips before we go. First, always try your very best. Next, don't get help answering questions. If you don't know the answer, it's okay. SuccessMaker will help teach you. And last, don't sign out before your session is over, unless your teacher says so. Well, that's it for now. We hope you learn a lot and have fun using SuccessMaker. Bye.